I'm, I'm devastated. A 37-year-old woman's husband explains what she says happened after the homecoming football game at Coolidge High School. He talked to us because his wife says she's scared for her life. Of course, who wouldn't be? According to the police report, after the game in the back parking lot on November 2nd, his wife, a former staff member at Coolidge, says she was attacked by three women. She claims it was two staff members and Principal Thelma Jarrett who assaulted her. That this was a high school principal that yes. was physically, physically hit her. Yes. It's not a leader at all. It was a monster, if you ask me. His wife claims Jarrett ordered the assault. The police report says one suspect said get her. Then the victim was punched in the face with a closed fist. She fell to the ground and was kicked. She says all three women kicked her. It's treated like a piece of meat. The husband says their 11-year-old son witnessed it and called his father, who had left to pick up the car. Dad, you need to come back because somebody just punched mommy. D.C. police said it's an open investigation and the matter was being taken seriously. But Terry Goings, the school's parent-teacher coordinator, is crying foul. That when I came onto the scene, that actually Ms. Jurd was trying to break up the confrontation. And another staff member who did not want to show his face on camera refuted the claims against the principal. But I never saw her get kicked, punched, or any assault at all. She was hurt bad. I give it about a, a nine, ten. She was hurt.